Welcome to Semi Living, where we're not zombies. Today, we're probably gonna make something really, really yummy, but not brains. So, we just did a video on the Road Pro lunchbox stove, and now we're gonna boil some eggs in this. So, Super easy. If you're rolling, you'll want to make sure you get the pan really good so your water doesn't leak. But so the first thing you need to do, plug it in and let it preheat a bit, and make sure it stays closed. You want the heat to stay in it and get to that top so it starts circulating. So the first thing you need to do is plug it in and let it preheat. So go ahead and take your eggs out of the refrigerator. Let them start kind of getting up towards room temperature. You're gonna boil your water first and then put the eggs in. So let get those out and let them start warming up. To make eggs easier to peel when they're done boiling, if you shock them in really cold water, it makes them easier to peel. So if you can, if you have a fridge, go ahead and put you a bowl of water in the fridge or go on the truck stop and get you some ice water. We're rolling, I gotta put water in the fridge. And I got a pan and some tin foil. So what I'm gonna actually do is put the tin foil under it. So if my water sloshes, it just, it goes into the tin foil. Okay, so I'm gonna, you want enough water in it that when you put an egg in there, it, it pretty much covers you. See how it's sloshing already? Okay. So I'm gonna take that out. Alright. And to make it boil quicker as well, I'm gonna add some salt. I'm gonna add about a half a tablespoon of salt. And it just helps it to boil easier. And my mama, my mama always said that it helped them to keep from cracking and that it also makes them easier to peel. So that was just one of the tricks mama taught us when we were kids. And then, oh, sorry. All right, so what I've, I'm just going to roll this up like this and fold up the sides. I'm gonna put it in the cooker, just like that, and let the water boil. So why the water is boiling? Do y'all wanna hear some jokes? Why it's bouncy, isn't it? We're out on US 54. And I think we're pretty close to crossing into Oklahoma. Are we in Oklahoma yet, Paul? Not yet? Yes. Oh, we are. Yeah. And if y'all have traveled 54, uh, see, even my camera won't stay. If y'all have traveled 54 out here, you know how bad it is. And sorry, anybody that lives in Oklahoma, I mean, no offense to you, but these roads, this little panhandle section, it, it it's really bad. I'm, I'm just saying, you know, we're headed west, and, you know, anyway, 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 y'all want to hear some jokes, so we, we won't get me off on a tangent about these ding-dang-dong roads, because if I get started, I'll probably never quit. These roads are terrible. All right, I'm shutting up now. So, how about some egg jokes? I didn't know a lot of egg jokes, you know, egg-centric, uh, that's no yolk. I guess the obvious. So, I found some jokes at Lapkin. And I'll, I'll, I'll post a link in the description. Okay? So, um, let me remember them. What crime is an egg most afraid of? Can you guess, Paul? You can play along. <laughs> He's, not... <laughs> He's like, don't even talk to me right now about that stuff. Poaching! Poaching. Poaching. Ha ha ha. 
That's funny. Yeah, you're supposed to laugh. Me? You ready? One more. You ready? Yeah, go ahead. How do monsters like their eggs? I'm not sure. Terra fried. Terra fried? <laughs> Terra fried. Oh my goodness. That one was my favorite. All right, y'all. So it's been 20 minutes. We're gonna check our water. It should be hot enough. All right. So to put them in, I'm gonna take a spoon, and that way they don't fall, and I'm just gonna kind of lay them down in there. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put four in. I wouldn't do more than four. You don't want to crowd the pan. And I might regret doing four because we're moving, but we'll see. Close it back up. Close it as quick as you can. So once your water gets back to the boiling point, unplug your cooker and just let the eggs sit about 10 minutes. They'll actually finish cooking in the hot water. And then get your ice water. Get your ice water. And open it up. Drop your egg down in it. We'll just do one for now. Drop your egg in it. Shock it a little bit. Let it sit in your ice water five or ten minutes. Let it get really cold. All right. So it's been in the water about ten minutes. Give it a good crack. And then just get them peeled. There you go. All peeled. Break it open. And look how pretty that is. Y'all see that? Is it isn't it pretty? Isn't it pretty? See it? See how it's all yellow and not green? And you can do this every day and have fresh boiled eggs every morning.